replaced the battery under warranty the following Monday. The other unscheduled stop came when Honda informed us that our fit was subject to a third recall. All four ignition coils were swapped to prevent stalling. Final testing indicated that the fit lost a step, or 0.2 second, in the quarter mile, despite posting an identical 5, 2, 60, mph time of 8.5 seconds. The broken in tires bumped skid pad grip to 0.82 grams and cut braking distance down to 166 feet, improvements of 0.04 grams and 15 feet. All in, including fuel, $3,165, and the cost to repair a chipped windshield, $50, the fit cost us $3,591 over 40,000 miles, making it the most affordable to run long-termer we've had since gas prices spiked roughly 10 years ago. Frugality is the least sexy of concerns, and the fit excelled at it. But it wasn't the paramour we wanted to take home on Friday afternoons. Call us overprivileged, but there's more to life than abundant cargo space and high gas mileage. We receive a lot of completely useless junk in the mail. When the charge it, jump battery quick charger arrived, we were skeptical of its claimed ability, mainly because there is an exclamation point in its name. It also provides two USB ports, suggesting it is adept at powering a tablet. When the Fitz battery died, we put charge it to the test and, much to our astonishment, it worked. In fact, the pack, with 200 amps of cranking power, worked so well on the fit that we connected it to a 1995 Mitsubishi Eclipse that had been parked and melting into our lot for three years, a car that was missing a battery completely, though we don't recommend you do this because the alternator could damage the booster. The exclamation point was earned when the tiny, roughly 6 by 3 by 1 inch battery started the Eclipse and allowed us to move it four parking spots over so our landlord wouldn't tow it. The $100 price tag www.digitaltreasures.com buys you the battery, AC and DC chargers, a carrying case, a set of jumper style alligator clips, and a three connection USB pigtail. We're gonna have